Welcome everybody, another day, another orange BMW. This time in the shape of this breathtaking Valencia Orange BMW M135i. As you can see, the paintwork speaks for itself. A statement car truly deserves a statement colour. But what else has this got for you? Aside from 316 brake horsepower delivered from the 3 litre engine, it's actually got some pretty cool features. Let's have a look. So, you've got your Xenon headlights with daytime LED running lights. You've got a black kidney grille with your chrome surround. And you've got a honeycomb grille and chrome accessories here. And you've got front parking sensors and washer jets. You've got the signature BMW 436M in dark admiral grey. And you've also got the Estrel Blue M branded caliper just behind. As I say, this paintwork really is something to behold in person. Yes, it looks good on video, but I can guarantee you it looks even better in the flesh. You've got your official M badge, not one off eBay, on the wing there. And you've got your ferret grey mirror caps with built in indicators. You've got a gloss black window surround which isn't de-chromed, it's from factory so it's not going to chip or mark off and you've got your heat insulating tinted privacy glass. Moving around to the rear, nice juicy booty, just what the boys like. As you can see, jaw tail pipes which when you put it in Sport Plus does sound extra naughty and you've also got parking sensors just there. So the boot itself it's automatic release and you are able to open it up. Not a bad size boot for a little hatchback. Like I say, you're not going to get everything in here. You could probably at a push get a push chair diagonally, but there's more than enough room for shopping or everyday usage. The bodywork itself, really good order. A car of its age, it's in great condition. So you have got the stunning deep gloss Valencia orange. No dents, no marks, no nothing that you're going to be surprised when you do come and view this car before you take it away and put it on your drive. But I think you need a little bit more convincing and I'm the man to do it. So the interior design and quality is everything you would expect from a BMW. Solid built, reliable and actually quite luxurious but it does retain its performance based feel so on the wheel itself of course it's multi-function of course it's m branded and of course it's napa leather so you have your cruise control here with your volume control and you also on this side have instrument cluster menu display you have options to move up and down you have voice control and you have bluetooth telephone as you can see, just behind, just here on the wheel, you also have flappy paddle for optimum performance driving. Moving down here, you have automatic lights, fog lights and instrument cluster contrast. The seats themselves, full black Dakota leather with black contrast stitching. No marks on the bolster. You get a lovely, as soon as you enter, aluminium M135i, aluminium door inlay. And on the door itself, you have electric mirrors and electric windows. Echoed throughout, you've got a carbon weave in aluminium. So, into the car itself. You've got a really nice, easy to use, non-distracting instrument cluster here. Everything you would need. And also, these two parts just below are digital. You have, for some reason, auto stop start, which actually in a car like this probably uses more fuel than it saves and you have keyless start. Here you have the professional media. Now I will give a bit of a disclaimer, my phone doesn't work with the BMW media. When I video it, you will get lined across the screen. Don't worry, it's not the media system, it's just my old spud of a phone. Underneath that, you've got hazard lights, door locking and your hot and cold blowers. You've got your CD player and your radio, and you've got your heated seat and air conditioning unit. Moving down, you've got your cup holders and you've got the staple piece of the interior, the semi-automatic gearbox. Really simple to use, delivers really nice smooth transitions between gears, even in Sport Plus. To use, simply click unlock, 
and pull down when the car is on. Moving here, you've got parking sensors and you've got here the Drive Select Mode Eco Pro for efficient driving, comfort for your normal driving, sport, speaks for itself, and sport plus for those who are very brave and like to see the tail end of the car just coming round nicely to the passenger window. And if that is a point you like, you have the really daring traction control off. Moving down here, you've got the iDrive. Simply put, it's the command system for the heart of the car. You can control everything from your Bluetooth to your media system, to the way that your car is set up in your driver profiles. You can literally control everything in this. Most importantly, you can access your prior service history. As I've said, you've got the aluminium carbon weave effect echo throughout, which really does go nice against the other black decoration. So, disclaimer time. There are those lines. There they are. Unfortunately, that is just something on my phone. As you can see, the screen itself is fine. It's just when I get too close, there you go. When I get too close, it does decide to do this. So bear with me. As you can see, you've got the professional nav, which basically means the image displayed within the unit takes full advantage of the entire screen. On a normal nav, it would only come to around here and be a shorter. You've got media, which can be Bluetooth, streaming, CD. You can have it stored on your hard drive, or you can put in a USB or auxiliary input. You yeah. also got DAB, needs no introduction. Really nice, crisp, clear sound. It's the obvious choice if you're going to listen to the radio. You can now also have FM and AM for those talk sport listeners. If I click onto the menu itself, multimedia, radio, Bluetooth, telephone. You also have navigation, contacts, BMW connected drive. And you also have vehicle information where all the other settings are. You can change from your sports display or vehicle status, that will bring up any fault codes, or you can check your engine oil, your brake pads, or your service history. We'll put it back on now, and there you go. We'll start that car up now so you can hear the noise. And there we go. Less than 22,000 miles from a 2014 car. It's exceptional value for money. So let's talk numbers. The 3 litre engine in this little lightweight car produces a staggering 316 brake horsepower. Doesn't sound a lot, but believe me, when you've got the control of that under your foot, it's absolutely raw. Or as we like to say, real, raw and authentic. I'll give you a quick taster now. Now as you can see, and as you can hear, that ain't no joke. This car is designed to be driven round B roads, on track, potentially sideward if you're aware of how to do so. And it's designed to surprise the bigger cars in its class who look at it and simply go, ha, what's that one series gonna do? Well, let me tell you, this one series is gonna do a lot. But we're not about that. Today, it's just a quick virtual test drive to show you the capability some of the features and that you can buy with reassurance from an award-winning garage for a reason so i'm going to go around this island i'm going to show you the steering there's no knocks there's no bangs there's no rubbing there's no anything like that to be concerned about and this one does actually come with indicators fitted as an optional extra ha 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 so Around the island as you can see there's no tire scraping on the body no tire scraping on the arch there's no issues no bangs no knocks no untoward surprises the gears itself the gears itself smooth nice transition no problem you can knock them down if you wish and you can use them in manual mode so at the minute I'm currently in manual mode now you can drive and change your gears by doing the flick down, so it's similar to a manual gearbox. Or if you prefer and you're a bit better driver, you can use the flappy paddles here to change up and change down. 
these give you the optimum control when driving what else have you got you've got cruise control you've got voice activation you've got bluetooth you've got pro nav unfortunately you haven't got harman kardon but the sound system as standard in a bmw is more than enough to keep everybody happy so what else have you got in the car you've got climate control you've got drive select you've got auto start stop you've got parking sensors and you've also got traction control on or off here we have the iDrive which is quite famous for all BMWs and that does allow you to control the media unit itself and the drivetrain and chassis of the car in further menus when setting up your dynamic profile and finally you've also got heated seats in the front and electric windows in the front all in all it's a pretty well spec car it's a great car to, no that sounds shit all in all it's a cracking little car it's a really statement color it's got a really statement driving experience and i would really recommend this for anybody who's in the market for something a little bit unique is after something that offers great performance with a lot of character but also reliability and efficiency something that the german build quality echoes throughout the industry so what we're going to do now we're going to get this up to 60 mile an hour take my hands off the wheel and demonstrate that it drives true and straight there's 60 and there's the oh, and there's the hands now as you can see the car follows the camber of the road and it doesn't pull to either the left or right hand side we're currently doing 40 miles an hour and our brake and as you can see no delay no snappiness no judder just efficient performance as what you would expect from the bmw m division the main ethos at emerald house of cars is that we want you as a customer whether that be returning or a potentially new customer to be welcoming to the emerald family in order to do this we treat every car to the emerald 128 point check prior to retailing doesn't matter if it's a car a van a bus whatever it is it gets the check that's both cosmetic and mechanical it just allows you as a potential new owner and family member to buy with the utmost confidence and reassurance and also get rid of that nagging doubt that there should be any maintenance required for the foreseeable future I'd love to hear any feedback on this video or if you have any further queries regarding this Valencia Orange BMW M135i. Please speak to one of the team at Emerald today and we'll be happy to assist with anything that you need to know. Thanks ever so much for watching and we'll see you next time.